What's up, my tiki friends? So today I'm gonna to be doing a little bit of a short road trip, <laughs> heading over to Three Vision Arts, my buddy Shane Park's place. Um, he has a, a, an art design tiki studio. Uh, he's awesome. I definitely encourage you all to check him out. I had him, I uh, asked him to do a custom uh, piece for me. So today we're gonna to go pick it up. So come with me. Oh, that's where I'm at right now. I gotta get the ears done. And I think then it's just on the fine detail, which will be pretty epic looking. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes when I make things, I kind of wish I came up with the idea so I would have something like this here at the house. But a little bit too much here so this will go very cool person and this is what we got so far all right now it's all about the detail which is what I use this thing for it's called a die grinder and this is what gets me and all this cool detail to really make Some more painstaking detail but it's the detail that makes a piece near perfect that's what I'm trying to do here <laughs> hey y'all what's up my tiki friends i'm here over at three uh vision art and i i wanted just to kind of uh ask you all some questions here how did you get started that was uh actually we had a, a fence in our yard and i had to take out a pole to move the trailer in the back when we were living in plant city which is real country and uh, the pool, I could never get back in the right spot. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to try to carve it up and see what happens. And I did. And my, my sister's kids came over and they loved it. And then the neighbors seen and they loved it. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to just start doing this because I wanted to come home from work and just kind of relax in my own kind of paradise without the hustle and bustle of the rest of the world and stuff going on. It's kind of an escape. Totally. That's awesome. So that's kind of how it started. Um, then, then he continued on with the tiki carvings. Um, he did that full time for a while, and now we're both doing this full time here. Um, you know, we've started. We've got the tiki's. We've got paintings. We've started um, recycling furniture. Yeah. Wow. Making them, um, you know, pieces that people want again. You know, yeah. that centerpiece. Totally. That, that's a conversation starter that that people are looking for. Upcycling is awesome, for sure. It's cool to have something that uh, we save from going into the waste, and, uh, and then we take it, show it a little bit of love, and send it back out in the world. And somebody enjoys it and takes real good care of it, and it's it's a really cool feeling to kind of help out on both ways, give people something nice, and kind of help out the planet a little bit by taking one totally. nice thing out of the out of the trash. Yeah, I love that. So tell me, what is your uh, tiki inspiration? Like, where do you get your, your tiki inspiration from? Uh, believe it or not, I didn't really know much about them at first, like years ago. But when I, I think, believe it or not, Disney World was kind of the enchanted tiki room. And then also, like, I used to watch Indiana Jones all the time. And I, I loved, like, the whole landscape. And 
how he's running through the forest. <laughs> it just, I was like, man, I, I want to have a yard like that. The exotic plants and everything, just something a little different. And then we're here in Florida, which is perfect because it's sunny all the time and you, you have all this culture kind of in that general direction. So uh, I wanted to come home and just escape world. And um, that really made me want to start making them. Just, now I see it. I see the whole culture and everybody that's in it. It's, it's crazy. It's awesome. I, mean, I never knew. I never thought in a million years I would be doing something like this. That's so awesome. I've always been a Survivor fan. Totally. Survivor we love episodes, Survivor. And then, I don't even yeah. know how many seasons there are now, but they always have. They're always in these cool locations. Uh huh. You know, it's like as escapism as you. Yeah, can get. totally. Um, they have us. You know, the cool little immunity yeah and, and just their whole setup is always so cool you know what's funny my wife and I always joke around there's only somebody from lakeland it, it, no joke there's only somebody from either central florida or lakeland we, we almost really love it out here <laughs> that's so cool so how can people get a hold of you so uh, let us know that's a good social media stuff absolutely social media we're on facebook we're on instagram we're on Twitter, but I don't really know much about... I, I'm not yeah. well with Twitter. Yeah, um, with yeah I agree. I'm the same way. <laughs> we have a YouTube channel, and it's all at Three Visions Art. Awesome. Awesome. We all really appreciate it. Um, I'm going to have just Shane really quick uh, show us the piece that I asked him to make. Y'all, this is so cool. Yeah, just that. Grab it real quick. To uh, a loop of Trader Sam's and all that. Oh, this is so cool. Look at that. Oh, I'm so excited. I, I sent him over a picture of this iconic mask and he made this, his own interpretation of it. It's awesome, it's robust, it's big. Um, you, you mind just spinning it around really quick? I know it's so heavy, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Look at what he did. He literally just took like a tree trunk and carved it. Oh, yeah. oh that's so awesome. Split Bro, down. this is so much artistry here. I think it looks gorgeous and beautiful. And uh, y'all reach out to Shane. Uh, if, you, if you guys want something like this or uh, any have any ideas or you like what, is, what he's doing here, reach out to him. More than anything, I think it's so important that we all support our local uh, artists, our, our tiki vendors. And y'all, I really appreciate it. Uh, this is awesome. Thank you so much, Shane. No problem, man. Yeah, man, this is so cool. This is gonna go in the new bar uh, that I'm gonna be building pretty soon. You guys remember to like, subscribe, you like content like this. Um, if you're watching this on Instagram, if you're watching this on uh, Facebook or YouTube, make sure you leave a comment below and uh, y'all just keep teaking, okay? Bye-bye. Right, <laughs>